talking to each other. We are off. Rasmu versus Picano. Sweet Coon versus Dark Rise. So this is actually a pretty, uh, pretty similar matchup in my opinion to Chandelure. Uh, Sweet Coon having Aurora Beam that goes through a lot of traps. Uh, if Picano needs to really lay off on his neutral Y or neutral A, excuse me, the little, the three little high tokens of field face. Because uh, Rasmu loves that Mirko button. Shout out to my my boy Borges Wilson in chat, my boy, the dankest memer in the TCG community. Shout out to you. But right now we have Rasmu Picano here on stream. Gets caught by the net. That allows the CA to hit. No, no just frame. Picano does not like the just frame, but he does like nightmare mode. CA able to punish. No, no. I want to see the new killer. I want to see 8Y come out. I want to see you CA that also. Tries for the... Oh, there's the new killer. The Raps may be able to close it out. 8A, Darkrai. Never mind, Darkrai. You have to have an answer to it. That's why it's affectionately called the new killer. This is like somebody who doesn't have a doesn't have an answer for it, it kind of wrecks their whole <laughs> their whole life. So, Rasmus seeming to have an answer for it. It goes with a hyper or a hyper beam. Hydro pump. Payday confirms. So Rasmus able to really run away with it. Say so this is kind of very, like I said, very similar to the Chandelure matchup. Freaking, or not freaking, Suicune just having a lot of answers. Suicune having a lot of answers to a lot of Dark Riot trap setups. So. We'll see if we go to a character select screen. I'm thinking yes. I'm thinking Breaks is coming out. Here we go. We're seeing most likely character change on Picano's end. Break scene coming out, most likely. Most likely we're going to see more mi mirror coats. Out of Rasky. Out of the Ember. In field place. Alright, we got Fox. We got Breaks in. We got Breaks in coming out. Suicune coming out from Rasmu. Say, Rasmu has said multiple times he really likes... He really likes the... Uh, excuse me, sorry. Uh, Picano has. Not Picano. Rasmu has said multiple times that he really likes to play Suicune because uh, he does not. There is no Suicune in Nebraska currently. So he's saying, yo, Nebraska, you free. You free to Suicune. We are right. This round working out a lot better here for Picano. They're going to be able to keep himself up in the air. Fire spin set up here for some chips. Oh, is this a punish? It's a punish. So he was pretty high in phase shift points, so if he was going to try for the 8Y, he probably wouldn't have gotten very far. Or 8A, excuse me. He probably wouldn't have gotten very far. Uh, but he could have tried to finish off the round with more damage. Yep, there's a Mirko, and now this game is even. Running Cresselia. That's tough. The Moon Duck. Whoa! First, that was the first confirmed. Oh my goodness, the miss spacing is really helping uh, Rasmi right now. That was also a first confirmed. That was also a first confirmed. There's a lot of first confirms that are being missed. It's, it's, that's not a first confirmed. So we'll see. Uh, we'll see what happens. Okay, he's able to secure it out, and Rasmi's spending it first. Round number two here. Rathry still si or not sitting on match point. Picano sitting on round point. Yep, Ember's coming out for the Mirko. Just hitting with the tip of the JX, but not able to confirm. And he loves his 8X too. Don't grab this man, because he will 8X you into oblivion. Able to hit with the full HRCH. You guys know you can CA Blizzard? I do now.
See, this is kind of like the Vortex that I kind of really like. See, it's either uh, if he can kind of get you to do one or two things to lose the round, Pakano's able to really capitalize. It seems like he makes one good read and then he'll make another, and then another, and then another. Not that was not a good read, though. That does a ton of damage because Suicune in rage. That was a... It could have seen another Miracle out there. Lady's blocking. Yep. Kind of so close to closing it out. He just needed to not push a button. If you didn't push a button, but oh, throw your cap at him. This might the cap might be coming here, ladies and gentlemen. Cap tech. The Kano with his cap tech. Uh, not yet. Calls out the jump and is able to hold the CA with the confirm here. It's a good, nice damage. Has to watch out for the mirror code again. See, he's actually going in for the boomerang because he does not want to deal with the Miracle shenanigans. Pulls up the light screen. If you want to be really spicy in that situation, you can actually grab Suicune out of their CA as they're coming towards you if you have enough spacing. Kano doesn't feel like being spicy. Doesn't want to have to deal with the 50 50 shenanigans. Whoa! Whoa! Flies right into the blizzard, though. He gets the shift. Mirror coat. He's been hit with that so many times. Rashmi loves that move. If you're ever going to fight Rashmi with Suicune, know that he's going to 8 x you on his wake up, and know that he's going to mirror coat every chance he gets. Mikano needs to close this out, and now he has to deal with the burst weekend. There's only 25 seconds left. Oh my! The most defensive grab that somehow worked. Uh, it's Suicune's poor grab, and then Mikano rearing back, pushing buttons. And Suicune, the water goes yourself. Absolute sheer cold.